Next few weeks, we're looking at some different perspectives of service and our nation's wars in the price of freedom. Tonight, Josh Rowe has the story of a woman who never served in the military, but did see a lot of war growing up in Europe in the 1930s and 40s. Josh. Kim Calvin today, Eva Gray is 90 years old. She lives in the Saudi Daisy area. She was born in 1926 in Yugoslavia. Early April 1941, the Axis forces invaded Yugoslavia. Eva Gray was just a young girl living on her parents' farm. She took over, and the SS men was mean men. They made the young boys go in the army, and if they don't go, they shoot them right there on the street. They forced her brother into the German army. Eva and her parents fled to Budapest. They left their home, but they could not run away from the war. They bombed, they tried to bomb a German factory up there. They bombed everything but the German factory and they killed a lot of people. When Eva was just 14 years old, her parents were killed in a bombing in Hungary. In just a few years, her entire immediate family was gone. She went to live with an aunt in Austria. Things were better there for a while until she and a friend went to a movie one afternoon. And we come out and there was a, I guess I call it Colonel, what you call him, SS man. And he said, hi Hitler. I said, good day. Of course, I was a little brat there by the time. I was about 14, 15, 16, you know how 16 young girls do. He said, I said, hi Hitler. And me and her both said, good day. And he said, I think I learned this to let the girls I listen. He said, get in the car. They put them in a concentration camp and kept them there for months. She barely ate and witness things she remembers clearly almost 75 years later. And then I seen him in the lineup men. So I made him go, Jewish man, naked, shoot him down, ditch him, and pull dirt over him. She says they eventually let her go because her brother was serving in the German army. She went back to Austria until the war was over. We were so glad to see this American come in except of the Russian. We were afraid the Russian might come in before the American. I went through all that war and I said, people don't realize what really war is. When the Americans got there, that's when she met Porter Gray, a soldier from North Georgia. How old were you when you met your husband? I was about 18. He brought her back to America. She didn't know anyone in this country and couldn't speak English. The first thing I see was the Statue of Liberty. She looked so pretty down in it. Water. I was so glad I know I was in America. She came here in 1947 and she's never been back. It was so wonderful to get to America. I couldn't understand it. Of course, good thing I was young. I don't think I could live through it now. No way. Eva Gray became a U.S. citizen in 1957. She and her husband had nine children. Her husband passed away several years ago. Kim. Josh, thank you very much.